Sydney headquarters, this is 7 News with Mark Ferguson. Hello and welcome to the very last day for the class of 2017 at Clancy Catholic College. Some would say today marks the beginning of an end. Others would strongly suggest it's the start of a brand new adventure. What's not in doubt is that the last six years have been filled with laughs, a few tears, lots of friendship and a lot of hard work. They are now memories, memories that will last a lifetime. Let's go to Giselle and Joseph at Clancy for the very latest. few moments later. Baldeo! <laughs> to be honest, Joseph Scrooper. Ooh! He's a joke. He's a joke. No, no, no. What a joke. <laughs> Why are you always lying? Are you planning on taking two? Woo! Who do you want to take two? Alicia Layton. Alice. Sorry, Baldeo. Probably Sebastian. Sebastian, you couldn't take it. But I like to give controversial, so I'd have to go with a lemon, Eric Messina. Not Vittoria Camusso. <laughs> <laughs> oh! 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 Who do you want to take to formal this year? Bianca. <laughs> Alright. Low key, lemon? No. No idea? No, no clue. Okay. All these guys. And the beautiful boy over there. This is gonna be a bit of a shock, but I asked him the same question. Oh my god. And he did say your name. Oh, that's alright. I know he's he, I know he's gay, secretly. <laughs> no. No. Um, my parents who were probably gonna drive. Oh, yeah, right. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah, yeah, my parents. Parents? No, I'm just feeling. Me? Yeah. Um, Albert. <laughs> They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. Jared. Take it, Jared. Jared! He wants to take you to formal. <laughs> I want to take Erica to formal. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> Do you want to ask me if I can? Right there. I mean, safe option would be brilliant since I've already been there, but. Don't say those things. Who's going to take the ball to tone? Hopefully. Oh, maybe Denmark? Yeah. Denmark coming for you. Alyssa. Yeah, I'm asked. Alyssa. She said no. I haven't asked her, but I'll ask Alyssa soon. A few moments later. PJ, PJ has a question to ask you. Oh, will you go for me? Whatever. Alyssa, of course. I'm uh, pretty sure PJ asked Alyssa, but. Uh, I already asked her first. Uh, who do you want to take the form? There's been a bit of controversy. Who do you want to take the I'm still tossing up between Matthew and PJ. Um. But yeah, I'm gonna have to think about that one. This girl, who I like, this little light skinned girl. I think she's called Shinani. The girl just heading around to uh, the, uh, the date asking, could be the moment that my man here, my man, I've got this, I've got finds, my man finds a date to form. By the way, uh, what are you planning on wearing for form? I'm um, in a blue checkered suit from politics. Sounds good, man. Sounds good. This is awkward. <laughs> okay. The wrong guy has a question to ask you. Yeah, yeah. No, no, talk up, talk up, talk up. I want to go! Give us a round. My sister! My favorite cake, that's caramel. <laughs> when I go to Macca's, I always get me a nice caramel pie, nice and hot. Now, Obviously, like, I want me a nice light skin queen. A nice, <laughs> nice light skin queen. <laughs> and I want to know if you, if you go to formal with me. I'd like to take Nino to formal. 
What about Toronto? Oh, I'm sorry, mate. <laughs> <laughs> okay. What were, you, what were your thoughts about that little um, Oh, I was put on the spot. It was kind of difficult. Um, I said okay, but I didn't really mean it. <laughs> uh, my lovely mother and her husband, Greg. Do you have a favourite student? <laughs> no, um, you're all my favourite. Oh, oh that's like, yeah! Best and worst memory of high school. Oh, I think they might know. Oh, they were oh, oh, of the, the pig. pig. <laughs> um, my worst one, I don't want to say. Actually, no, we're doing worst rugby league. Go for it. Uh, best memory would probably be um, getting college captain. Worst memory. I thought we'd be like hanging with your mates, you know what I mean? Like that lunch time that we spent together. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. Worst memory is probably like my pants at Clancy Day twice. It was probably when Stojo flashed all the boys in year seven. <laughs> Most embarrassing death memory from high school. This rumor going about, <laughs> I'm not gonna oh, say yeah, it, but it's an interesting story. If anyone wants to know it, they can just come see me. Hey. It involves milk and chili. Most embarrassing, I was new to the school and um, I was walking out of the bathroom and I didn't notice that I had toilet paper all stuck to my arm. <laughs> and Miss Malfani called me, she's like, oh, did you worry? I was like, she goes, you got it. I was like, ah! And then I ran back in, picked myself up. Skyco coming back from his photography. I see that one went off in the corner of the room. Worst would probably be the horrible weather that we've had, the rain. <laughs> Year 9 camp and the worst. Probably just like when I forgot my lunch at school. Joint answer Jarvis getting shot on by a bird twice. Oh, the when he was talking inside the circle. That was yeah. right. <laughs> so, best would definitely have to be year 12 retreat when you broke the light. Worst would be probably when I, in year 8, where I have vomited everywhere. <laughs> That was the most embarrassing moment of my life by far. It was horrible. I didn't come to school for a whole week. Um, not even. <laughs> Isabella just burped. <laughs> uh, you're an animal and you look like one too. What's your uh, best and worst memory of high school? You know, my best memory was when my dad, aka Mark Bologna, at the real Mark Bologna on the Twitter. Um, you remember when he did that rap, uh, Gangsters Paradise? That was lit. You know, I just. He should have got a Tony Award for that, but it's fake. It's fake news. It's rigged. It's corrupt. It's a bad, bad experience for me to see my dad up like that. But, you know, anyway, we got to deal with it. we got to live and learn. Probably when I was in SOR watching Daddy Donald Trump win the presidency, and Bologna kept telling me to turn off my laptop, but we ignored him. And Florida became Republican. That was good. That was good memory. Oh, when Bologna accused me of disrespecting Chiara Vosso, because I respect women. Favorite memory from this year? Senior retreat. The senior retreat was probably the most exciting and um, fun time. And um, the swimming carnival, the dances at the swimming carnival. Not making Mr. Mangia in the uh, teachers versus students games and winning. Probably falling off my bunk bed at retreat. <laughs> Best memory was um, playing in the AFL grand final, and the worst one was having a massive panic attack at the top of the. Um, at one of the climbing things that you know I can. I used to follow around Joe Bikosik and he found out. <laughs> so embarrassing. I thought I was a bit of a psycho. Um, expected ATAR. Mystery mark, definitely. You don't, you're not aiming for over 65? <laughs> HSC seems. <laughs> Our favourite teacher is Mr. Ha. Yeah, he real. He, he, can, oh, he, he holds it down for us. You know, sometimes he tells me to like shut up and stuff. But like, I appreciate honesty. My favourite teacher, old man right here. He's a real OG since day one. Mr. Bologna. Mr. Bar. Yeah, that's all. I say Greg, because I've had him for Yeah. Uh, I'm actually either Volcado or Mamo. Or who? Um, you'll know Jeffrey Chemist, AKA Dad. He knows that address, so I can tell you. Uh, Mr. Volcado. Um, Mr. Garland. Oh, Miss Borg. Why? I don't know. Why? Look at the camera and say why. No, man, she's a good teacher. She, she's, uh, she's very smart. Did you say you wanted to take it a formal? No, it's Giselle. Who, Miss Borg? Which teacher are you going to miss most? Miss Boo? Yeah, probably Boo. Because I actually know I'm not going to miss her. I see her like every single day, every single period. I'll probably miss Boo on your age. Uh, Mr. Spuna, Mr. Ha. Miss Gan. It's like my mum. If you could uh, describe your high school experience in three words, what would they be? Lit XD fam. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, that's one. Just respect women. It was. Daniel Skoko! 
Daniel Lopez. Nicholas Bell. Oh, it's a lie, it was John! <laughs> Everyone knows this one. It was Nicholas Bell. <laughs> I was practically in love with him, but he didn't love me back. Oh, no. And Jeremy! <laughs> we should do one. Our future fear. Oh, yeah, it's no joke. Back in the I think it was Georgie. <laughs> Just a quick question. What's your what's your expected ATAR? <laughs> Look, I'm just trying to get 100%. Right, um, do you have any moves you want to pull off at formal? Oh, the bark will come out the final time. Do you want to do you want to give an ex like a demonstration? <laughs> do you mind chucking us a quick um, <laughs> whip and dab or yeah? Now watch me whip. Now watch me nae Yeah, can you sing a song? How do I get through one night without you? Oh, hey, 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 hey. hey. You can bet on me if you want to. These are expensive, these are red bottoms, these are blood shoes. Hit the score, I can get them both. I don't want to choose, and I'm quick. Cut a nigga off, so don't get comfortable. Look, I don't dance now, I make money. Can you give us your best example of how you're going to dance a formal? Um, I'll chuck a muzz. Yeah, yeah, this is my, um... Oh, you're not going to do it. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> I think it's called the worm, but it's like not like the worm with your it's, it's just the worm. Um, no, 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 no. Do you have any tips for us at formal? Get lit. <laughs> what does get lit mean? <laughs> behave. But behave, but enjoy yourself because it's probably the last time you'll see your no, all your group together. Would you date Michael Hayward? Oh, maybe he's a bit taller. Consider it. <laughs> Dad, say it. <laughs> <laughs> 70s, 80s? Not ATAR. Yeah, tips are formal. Behave yourself. Make sure you're good at the after party. What after party? Uh, have fun, enjoy it, and I'm sure you all look beautiful. And the guys, the gentlemen, will all look very sharp, and I'm looking forward to that final day. <laughs>